हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज देवाशिष एंड दिस इज एन एड शार्पनर प्रोडक्शन वेलकम बैक मेनी पीपल हैव बीन टेलिंग मी टू मेक वीडियोज इन इंग्लिश वेल आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट मेकिंग वीडियोज इन इंग्लिश सो दैट आई कैन रीच मोर ऑफ द ऑडियंस इन इंडिया एंड वेरी सॉरी दैट माई अर्लियर वीडियोज आर प्योरली इन हिंदी आई एम कम्फर्टेबल इन हिंदी माई इंग्लिश इज इन वेरी गुड बट आई ट्राई इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू अ ट्रेड ऑफ बिटवीन चूजिंग अ बेटर कॉलेज and choosing a better branch for yourself see uh, people are asking me in doubts in the live sessions that i did and there are so many doubts so many confusions and the main uh, main kind of a doubt is uh, what like they have a particular college but not the branch they want and then they have a particular branch they want in a college that probably is not that good i am going to answer this doubt as well as i am going to tell you some thumb rules on how to make such decisions of your life see this is not going to be preaching about how to like take decisions overall in life and how to be and what to do not like that but very simple things that i went through and that i did for myself so let me tell you first the uh, the story behind uh, how and why i became an engineer first of all if everybody of you uh, like remember why did you take the decision to be an engineer uh, according to me everybody will say like somebody influenced them somebody inspired them and people told them bahut scope hai there is a lot lot of scope and everything uh, yes that was true uh, like 10 10 years ago uh, india was becoming a service based company there is a cheap labor in india and if you have good enough graduates who can like communicate well in english if they have some minute hands on skills they can let's say code they can test um, india was becoming a big market for soft, software companies that actually pushed everybody saying uh, that engineering has a lot of scope but it is always it has always been a problem in india that there weren't enough core jobs right people always wanted government jobs because there was security in the job and of course there were those all the perks that there are that market suddenly like boomed like 10 years ago but is it relevant now engineers are not necessarily working as engineers now including myself sorry for this vehicle okay so what i'm saying is the relevance of engineering is going to change after you you now you are an engineer after 10 years the relevant relevance will be different right the thing is what i am going to tell you is that according to me when i became an engineer somebody inspired me somebody went to an iit and i was like after 12th i want to do like je and then i will go to iit because i thought respect was associated with iit and that was a pure reason people respected everybody who went to iit um, they respected i i wanted the respect and who doesn't want respect so that was my main uh, like drive when i started preparing for je and i failed and that was a huge ego hurt for me of course it will be why wouldn't it be because uh, somehow i prepared for it and now i was not getting the respect i wanted there is no scope for failure in indian society now then i decided i settled on to a different college all that i wanted was to get an admission because because i prepared for je only i did not prepare for any other exams sadly and i had to settle for a branch now what i'm going to tell you is if you are such a person who settled for a particular branch who did not have any inclination just an inspiration of engineering that there is going to be a job the thing for you is that you should choose better college for your mtech this is the decision that i am going to tell you if you have no aspirations as to work in a particular field of like say uh, i wanted mechanical right from where i was born or uh, right after my btech like in the 12th standard only i knew i am going to be a mechanical engineer and i am going to work like that if you are such a guy uh, or such a person guy or girl Do, don't listen to this thing but if you are a guy who will be saying that uh, i was i was not aware of any branch like mechanical engineering i didn't know what what happens in mechanical i didn't know what happens in civil i just knew people build buildings and that's what we call civil engineers 
and then the people who work with cars are the mechanical engineers and then there is there is so much in every branch right which you don't know in computer science people are like okay you will get a job so they study computer computer science and then their abstract mathematics skills are not that as good and then they fail so basically everybody started doing engineering because they thought they, uh, they had a scope and now if you are not rigid if you lucky uh, if you are like lucky enough to not have that rigid opinion about branch that's fine it helped me take a decision i settled on a particular branch in btech then i just decided i wanted to be in a good college so that i give myself more opportunities as to play with after mtech like when i was taking admission in mtech the thing was i was not even looking for a particular branch i applied everywhere aerospace i applied for let's say i think uh, physics and instrumentation in isc i applied for electronics in iit guwahati i applied for power system power electronics in iit bombay biomedical engineering in iit bombay energy studies in iit delhi i applied in a diverse area just so that i give myself an opportunity i did not even apply for nits so i was clear in my mind that i just wanted to go to a good college why i say that is because i knew going in a good college will give me more opportunities to explore my interests right this is what is needed in my btech college i did not have a lot of opportunity where i could explore my interests that was a problem when i went to iit of course i had a huge stage i i did did a lot of theater but also i i explored that i really like teaching i really like research and this is how i could explore it because i had those facilities at the same time there were so many companies coming in iit delhi and i could give a lot of interviews only thing i did not know was coding and that's why i did not get get placed so of course if you want to get placed you need to have certain skills but it's important that you give yourself huge amount of opportunities in mtech it's good for a, a person like you who is uh, studied who has studied so hard for gate and then is taking admission in mtech and if you choose a branch which you really like like you want to work in let's say thermal engineering but w- what is the guarantee that you will actually love your job there is no guarantee i can guarantee you that even if you have your dream job if you earn so much of money in thermal engineering let's say that's what you want it's a guarantee that you will not love every day of your job there are going to be challenges there are going to be days when you will not love your job i wanted to be an assistant professor i joined i did not like the job i left it i changed my dream i cha- i changed all my track i became a freelancer and this is how it works you are just 25 years uh, old and you cannot settle for like you cannot say that this is something that i want to do for lifetime no this is not how human mind works this is not how humans work humans love challenges and humans like the change that's why they change the jobs okay let's also take this example that if you if you are doing your dream job in a particular field what will be a like what will be the type of your job or how will be your day maybe you are placed in let's say some mechan- if you are a mechanical engineer let's say you are working with boilers all right what will be your task you know you will like go to every boiler and you'll check if the boiler is working fine for let's say first year then second year you will be like on a managerial position it will be like very very niche task in that particular field so even if you are working in a mechanical core job you will be very uh, like you'll be working with a very monotonous task probably there won't be as many challenges as you would like also because you specialized in a very very narrow field you did not choose let's say an interdisciplinary branch or not a lot of spread opportunities lessen for you let's say you just want that kind of a job you do not you do not sit for other placements and then you do not give yourself a good chance so if you want to do mtech just because you want to increase your chances of getting placed or you want to earn money for your family it's advisable that you choose a good college and i have told in many of my videos if you want uh, the good college means the older college where more alumnus base is present more companies come the college is very famous if the college is not that famous there is no point in joining the branch you like of course after that even there is no guarantee that you will love your job even if you get 
core job my suggestion for you is to spread your knowledge now is to spread your skill set and choose a branch uh, which could be interdisciplinary or do not focus on branch a lot try to focus on a college all right it's a great thing if you are getting a branch that you like in a college that you like but i would say choose a college better than anything another my personal experience is like i was an instrumentation engineer i am an instrumentation engineer after bachelor's of technology after my btech i did a job for one year in fluor daniel gurgaon it was a core job i was working as an instrumentation design engineer all right i was working in a control systems department i was working with let's say pn ids and i was enjoying that of course i enjoyed that but later on there is just the ceiling there is always that ceiling where you just reach and then you cannot break it because that promotion those promotions happen like you go to a different stage and now you work with the team of five people and then you tell them what to do but ultimately what you are going to do is to uh, procure instruments for a refinery that's what you are going to do for a lifetime and you do not then gain other skills now obviously i i am i am doing different things obviously and i am learning a different things i love that kind of a challenge if you are that kind of a guy all the point is if you are that kind of a guy who in who was inspired due to some random reason to do engineering who did not look at the branch specifically who just chose the branches because they thought or somebody told them that there are going to be jobs so if you are that kind of a guy choose college over any branch you could you have the potential to learn anything new and you give yourself a better chance if you choose good college over good branch all right that is my suggestion to you now if you have any questions about this uh, please let me in the comment section maybe people will disagree with this but this is my opinion this is not something that you need to listen to you can take some snippets or points out of this and apply it to your decision making but i'm trying to just help you in making decisions of those sort okay because these are like your life depends upon it somebody chooses to like do government job they will do government job just because of the security but probably they'll not be happy right now is not the time to uh, like thinking about settling and thinking about not taking risks you are not 30 or 35 years of age you are young you can experiment and you can put challenges in your life and then you can transform yourself you can be a better person try to do different things in mtech try to learn different skills try to shift jobs be eligible for as many jobs as you want otherwise it would be like in a matrimony uh, like a matrimony website where like you have those conditions yahi caste chahiye yahi religion chahiye yahi ladki chahiye aisa chahiye waisa ladka chahiye itna bangla hona chahiye i the guy should have this much of package or the girl should be this much tall whatever those nonsense reasons that you uh, see in matrimonial uh, like conversations or something like that in such cases the things don't really work out well you just have to settle for the marriage then and you need to be able to compromise in all the cases just make sure that you get a lot of opportunities and that will be possible if you choose a good college all right so let me know in the comment let me know in the comment section what you think let me know if you disagree if you if you like this video i'll i'll say okay you agree you can also dislike the video obviously uh if you disagree with this but that's what i think and let me know uh what else would you like to know if you have not subscribed to this channel please do because lot more i'll be putting in front of you and that too will be in english i'll be working on my own english and also will be working on your english as well because i want you all to be better in english okay so see you soon milenge jaldi ek naye video ke sath tab tak khele gyan pite rahiye bye bye